Do you think there should be limits on immigration? No, I think Britain's big enough to house more immigration. How much, just to have an exact figure? I'd say about half the world's population could fit into Britain and we probably wouldn't notice a difference. It's never been tried. Yeah, I mean, what do I do when I'm on a crowded tube and I'm getting a bit crushed? I simply turn to the man or woman or transgender person who's crushing me and I say, would you mind moving over a bit? And then he or she or the transgender person moves and it's a bit uncomfortable, but, you know, we usually get home fine and safely, you know? Earlier today, I was badly beaten up by... Don't say immigrants. It wasn't immigrants. Good. It was a pony stampede. If it was a pony stampede, you can't say that you were beaten up by ponies. Sure you don't think they were responsible? Yeah. The ponies? No, actually, I was responsible. They were on the far side of the street and I crossed the road and ran in between them. Were they stampeding before you ran in between them? No, I caused the stampede. The ponies went berserk and ran in all directions. Well, there you have it, really, you know. People who complain about immigrants, they're usually the cause of the problems they associate with it. Yeah. One last question. I noticed a huge cage, a mini zoo with a rope swing outside. Would you consider housing asylum seekers here in your own home? Hoof print. I mean, we couldn't believe it, could we? I mean, it's scraped through by about, what was it, four votes? I think that if something scrapes through by four votes, it's the same as saying that that's actually less than a majority. So what we have here is a minority dictating terms to a majority. That's not democracy. Our childminder is from Spain. What's going to happen to her? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's actually quite a difficult thing to talk about because um, she's actually had a child by Rob, so she may be able to stay in the country. Or I could move to Spain. I don't think I'm in a good way. It's a difficult time.